Is there famine in Gaza? If so, is it Israel's fault? I am here with a math lesson, not girl math, actual math. So far, Israel has sent in about 234,000 tons of food to Gaza. According to calculations, based on the UN's World Food Program, it would take 4,287 tons of food to feed the 2.2 million Palestinians in Gaza for one week. So how long could this 234,000 tons of food last the entire population of Gaza? Well, what is 234,000, the amount of food sent in by Israel so far, divided by 4,287, the amount of food needed per week to feed the 2.2 million civilians of Gaza? Well, look at that. It's 54.58, meaning enough food for 54 and a half weeks. That's over a year. How many weeks has this war been going on? About 25. So according to basic math, Israel has sent in more than double the amount of food needed. Perplexing, isn't it? Do you know what's even more interesting? More food has gone into Gaza from Israel than before this war even started on October 7th. And yet, we keep hearing that Israel is trying to starve Palestinians and withhold aid. We are living in a world where people will sooner believe a murderous terrorist organization rather than the facts of basic math and the reality of the truth. So what is happening to all that aid? Well, we know for a fact that Hamas is stealing much of it, and they do this to take care of themselves, to control the distribution of the goods, and to strengthen their position as the rulers of Gaza. They have no problem forcing their civilians to suffer in order to turn the world against Israel. Hamas's goal is to create an image of a serious humanitarian crisis in Gaza and then to blame Israel for it. And it's working, even though it is based on lies, thievery, and terror. But despite it all, Israel continues to send in humanitarian aid to Gaza, not because international law compels them to, not because world opinion compels them to, but because it is their moral code, because Israel actually cares about the civilians of Gaza, unlike Hamas. Do not believe Hamas's lies. Please share this video and spread the truth.